On Tuesday, 25th of November, Dunleary Further Education Institute hosted the 2015 Dublin News Academy Conference. How many here would like a career in journalism? Far more, far more. So that tells you something about the attractiveness of uh, both careers and uh, the interest that people have um, in journalism and in politics. And yet the two worlds, you know, very often come together, obviously. And as a politician, I have engagement with journalism, uh, with journalists, uh, in quite an intense way. I think I've picked an interesting career. It's a challenging career. Um, I think those of you who are interested in journalism, uh, I think you are picking a very interesting and challenging career uh, with a lot of opportunity. Launched by the Minister for Justice and Equality, Francis Fitzgerald, speakers included representatives from the Irish Sun and the Sunday Times Ireland. You're always going to attract criticism no matter what you do, no matter how well researched your piece is, um, how legally sound it is, there's always going to be someone out there who doesn't like what you have to say just because you've said it. News Academy's mission is to invest in the future of journalism, helping and inspiring the next generation of those who might one day work in the industry. Echo what, what, what Tony and Rebecca said, you just, you, you know, the race to be first isn't the right race to be in, it's the race, the race to be right. I think, you know, you, you use Twitter and Facebook and Snapchat and Instagram as purely as news sources, they're primary sources of, of, of news now. But they still require the checks and balances, they need to be fully verified, and you go when it's right. The Dublin News Academy Conference debated the role of citizen journalism, and through smaller workshops and a mock press conference gave his attendees an insight into their potential future careers.